Aaron, considering where you had them heading into the ninth, just how tough is this one before the break? Yeah, it's it's another gut punch. You know, we've we've had a we've had a number of those obviously here in the first half, and uh, you know we've gotten off the mat each and every time, and you know, we got to do it again and understand um, you know what's at stake starting Thursday. We got a huge series. You know, this is a time to obviously refresh, make sure our minds and our bodies are, are taken care of over these few days off. And, uh, you know, we've got a lot at stake starting on Thursday, and it's in our hands. Uh, you know, this one, you know, I've said it a handful of times how much some of them have stung. And obviously, as well as we played this week, to not finish it off right there is, is difficult. But we got to rally from the adversity of it. What did you see from Chad in the ninth? Did he? Did you think he had his good stuff? He was ob obviously a little bit off with his command, leaving some stuff up there early. And I also, I actually thought he he rallied there and kind of found it a little bit, um, and then just still made a couple of mistakes. Though I, I thought he regrouped all right against Castro, even though he dumped the hit off of him. Had a you know a good sequence to Maldonado and then Altuve and. Um, so obviously didn't have it today. Um, and I, I thought early on it was a matter of getting his sights in line where his command was a little bit off. Thanks, Aaron. Hi, Aaron. Wondering, do you chalk this up just as a bad finish in frame or do you think there are some serious concerns on how this game ended? Well, I, I mean, I chalk. Look, it's it's the ultimate gut punch. You got a five run lead in the ninth and a chance to sweep a great team and, and they come back and leave you standing. Uh, you know, that hurts a lot, obviously. Uh, but Greeny's been about as good as anyone in this first half. And, you know, it's going to happen every now and then. They get a little chopper to start things off. Um, so, you know, obviously we got to get some things right. Uh, you know, you know, obviously important. We get we get some guys going in our pen that 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 can also be contributors and, and important contributors, and they will be. Um, so, yeah, we got some things to still uh, get better at and, and make sure, you know, every all hands are, are where they need to be. Aaron, where is uh, your trust level with Aroldis Chapman? Did you have him? Um, why not bring him in? I, I just, look, I'm trying to get him into situations where, you know, I think he's so critical, obviously, to our success, and it's critical that I think we get him back to where we need him to be. And I want to pick those situations where I think uh, he can get those, where he gets a, a clean outing under his belt, and where um, you know today, you know, with Domingo kind of cruising Duke through there and having the lead, I was comfortable with that. And then once it became a safe situation, you know, I wanted to go with Greeny there. Aaron, after a loss like that, do you say good thing we have the All Star break, or is it tough because you got to sit with it until uh, next week? Look, it's a little of all that, you know. Um, the timing of it, you know, you certainly want guys, especially some guys that are banged up. Um, you know, the, the the few days rest is is important and and serves a purpose, and I think helpful for a lot of reasons. Um, but you also want to, you know, we, we want to get back out there. We want to play. Uh, and and as much as this one hurts today, you know, kind of got things going a little bit this week, doing a lot of things well. And we got to continue that. And, and, and we need to continue that heading into Thursday. Can go back to the chair. Just want to piggyback off the, the good feelings this week, Aaron. And one of those was uh, Jamison Tyone. What's your confidence level? Because it seems like he's really started to lock in the last two starts, especially going forward into the second half, your confidence level in him. Uh, yeah, I really like where he's at. Again, I, I think he's expanded his repertoire to make him more versatile, um, give him different looks, give him different weapons against different kinds of hitters. And, uh, you know, he's, he's filling up the strike zone. He's pitching with a lot of confidence. I think physically he feels really good. So, um, yeah, I certainly like where he's had heading into the second half.
Um, despite today's finish, can you at least have some positive takeaways? You guys winning two out of three against an impactful Houston team that's huge on offense as well as Seattle? Look, I think the positive takeaway is that we're playing well, and we need to make sure we understand that. And there's a lot of good things happening. Um, it doesn't take the sting away from today. Again, we're not into, you know, of course, it's great to win series, and you go on the road trip, and you go on a West Coast trip to two winning teams, and you take four out of six. Of course you take that. But you also understand the opportunity in front of you today to, uh, you know, finish off a sweep and to finish off a great road trip. So that's going to stick with you, and that's painful. But we also got to we got to move on from it and, and understand that the stretch we're about to embark on is too important and too great an opportunity, and we have to build on the things that we're doing well. Aaron, they, uh, the Astros clearly reacted a little bit to what Aaron uh, did the yesterday. What? I'm sorry. Yeah, the what? Sorry. The Astros reacted to what Aaron did yesterday, rounding the bases with Maldonado doing that and Altuve after the, the game. Did you, do you think that what, what Judge did yesterday might have provided a spark for the Astros? I, not really. I, I really don't even have any interest in it. I mean, we, we coughed up a 7-2 lead. I don't think it had anything to do with any of the things that the extra stuff people are talking about. Okay. Yeah.